Thanks for tuning in. I'm Shannon Chavez with Around the Bluff. Hey Dukes fans, thanks for tuning in to Around the Bluff. I'm Shannon Chavez. Hey Duke fans, thanks for tuning in to our first episode of Around the Bluff. Each week I'll be diving into a team who's been performing well on the field or on the court. I'll sit down with a head coach and some key players to gain some insight into what's going on with the team. Check out what's happening this week in men's and women's basketball. Hey Duke fans, I'm here with freshman forward Quevin Winters. Uh, Quevin, there's been a lot of adjustments made to the men's basketball program this season. Uh, and not only is this your first uh, season playing for Duquesne, but we have a whole new uh, head coaching staff. Could you talk a little bit about where you started off and how the transition's been coming into playing collegiate basketball? Um, first off, I started playing high school basketball in Milwaukee. Then I transferred to Old Mark Christian Prep, a prep school in Florida. And then I did a post-grad year in uh, Charlotte, North Carolina. So coming from Milwaukee to prep school, you know, it was a tough transition. Things were different. Classes were different. You know, it was more structure. But, you know, that helped me out. And now making a transition to college has been real fun. It's been exciting and it's been hard work. And I'm just ready for the season. Okay. Um, and uh, who's been in your inspiration uh, in, in this whole process? Um, first off, you know, always God and you know, my family, you know, they, they support me 100%. You know, they always got my back, you know, and my mom, my dad, you know, they work hard and seeing them do that, that's something I, I wanted to do and I, that made me want something out of life. Okay, um, and, you know, uh, as a role model now, um, what could you tell a high school student who kind of wants to make it to the same level as you? Um, you know, just, just work hard, you know, always go to class, always just go as hard as you can. You know, when you work hard, the sky's the limit. And uh, you guys have the Duke's Caravan coming up this weekend, Saturday at Ross Park Mall. Um, you're going to get to interact with the fans a little bit about uh, a little bit um, for the first time. What are you uh, looking forward to going into that? I'm excited. You know, I'm excited to meet the fans. You know, see the atmosphere, and just I'm just excited to see everyone come out, sign autographs. You know, and just make people day. Alrighty. Well, good luck uh, as you guys start practice ne next month, and I'm um, excited to see you on the court this year. Thank you. Thank you. Hey Duke fans, I'm here with freshman point guard April Robinson. Uh, April, this is your first year at Duquesne um, and could you just talk a little bit about the transition coming from playing high school basketball in Virginia to coming into uh, the collegiate level here at Duquesne? Um, it's definitely different. I mean, high school we have class all day and then um, practice, but here it's um, work out in the morning, class and then breaks and then class again and then more um, playing. So it's definitely different, it's more of a job here. So Okay, and um, you know, what are you excited about uh, going into the season? I know you guys don't really start practice until next month, but you've already begun workouts, you know, lifting uh, and getting settled into a new environment. So what are you excited about for actually getting into the season? Um, I'm just excited to play for Coach Serio. Um, she's a great coach and just to play with my teammates and accomplish big things this year. Um, and I noticed in the social media release, uh, your teammates call you the mute spitter. Uh, as a point guard, I think a lot of people would probably expect that you're a little bit more vocal. Um, how do you communicate on the court? Um, I'm more of like a hand signal, eye contact type of player, but coach has been getting on me about uh, talking louder, so that's one thing I'm going to definitely work on a lot this year, just so my teammates can hear me and be the leader on the court. Awesome. Okay, and um, also you guys have Duke Caravan uh, this weekend um, at Ross Park Mall. Uh, you'll get to interact with the community a little bit. Uh, what are you What are you looking forward to most about that? Um, just probably seeing all the fans come out and have a good time and us pretty much bonding with the team as well. So I think that's what I'm looking forward to most. Okay, um, and also just uh, lastly, coming into a new environment, um, what's it been like so far building relationships with your coaches and your teammates on and off the court? Um, at first I was extremely nervous, um, kind of scared of the older girls, but now I think I've built like a good relationship with all of them. So. Yeah. Okay, well, good luck with everything. I'm excited to see you play this year. Thank you. Thank you. I want to give a special thanks to both men's and women's basketball teams for taking the time to sit down with us, and a special thanks for you for tuning in. See you again next week for Around the Bluff, Thursday, same place, same time. Sup, Duke fans? Jay Spinks here with uh, Duke's One on One. So, uh, here today, you know, What's going on? First, that, and the third. You know, chilling. Thanks for tuning in.